Our final brush tool down here is the color replacement tool. I'm going to zoom in on the mast up here. Let's say I wanted to have a different color for this section. I can do that using different colors up here and that particular color replacement tool right down there. Now on this tool you have a brush size as you can see. Bring it down a little bit in size. We have contiguous or discontiguous. This means it's either going to stay next to the brush or it's going to choose anything which is that same color on the picture. We'll stay next to our brush here. We have some options. We have hue, saturation, color, or luminosity. So you can change any one of those options. We'll just do color. Let's say I wanted to change this from this color to a, a bright green color. There we go. I'll just choose that bright green. Now notice there is a little cross here in the middle of that circle. The circle is the paint area. The cross here is the color that you're changing. As long as that cross here stays inside your color area, that circle will find the edges where it changes and will keep from painting outside those edges. You can see right there. As long as I keep that cross here inside the blue, then it's going to find those edges for me and keep those edges clean. Notice how it doesn't color any of that detail in there. It's just changing the color of that section. Okay, let's zoom out a little bit here. And there we go. We've now changed the color of that little bit in there using this color replacement tool. Let's just do something else up here at the top. Let's color some of these windows a little bit different. Same tool. And let's just make some of them a little bit brighter. I'll just grab this maybe this, this lighter tone here. And again, just kind of paint in side just like that. And as long as I keep that cross here inside of my painted area, then the tool will find the edge for me and it won't paint past that edge. So it allows me to come in and do some careful color adjustments or color changes just in a very confined area. In this case I could convert these kind of bad looking purple windows to a little more pleasant blue windows which might look better in this particular picture. So there we go. That's the color replacement brush. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you found it useful. If you like this video, click on the like button below to let others know. You can click the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my videos in the future. I'm frequently uploading new training videos. Don't forget to check out my website at howtogurus.com. You can share this video with your friends and coworkers. Just click on share and then click on the social media buttons. Feel free to comment on my videos. I try to answer all comments as quickly as I can. And finally, you can get all of my training videos on DVD at howtogurus.com. Thanks again for watching.